When there is a need to buy a car, what easily comes to mind are popular brands like Toyota, Honda, Volkswagen. However, have you ever wondered what it means to build your own car? Well, wonder no more. Wikendil came across a Nigerian inventor and researcher who did not only manufacture his car but also drove it from one city to another. This time he was in Makudi, the Benue state capital. This is made in Nigerian jet car, everyone video jet car. My name is Duro Jaye Kainde Obasanjo. Is this this vehicle? I'm the, I'm the inventor, researcher, and also the aero and video mobile engineer. Mm. I built it with our local material in Lagos. It's designed to move on sea, to move on land and fly. But out of the operation, I've achieved two. I moved this one on land and on the sea, and it has been tested. I drove it all the way from Lagos to Abuja, Abuja to Enugu, from Enugu back to Cross River. I'm now at Benue State. We are here to see our governor and the deputy governor. Yeah. 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 The car, though funny looking, is like a cross between a space rocket and a tricycle. It also looks like something from a sci fi movie. <laughs> Wherever it goes, people swamp him and his invention. Are you happy with this? Yes. Yes. This is a very good idea I mean, because it's not easy for one to think and uh, sit and think of this. I'm very happy by seeing a Nigerian man doing this kind of something. I pray that the person that consulted so that let God give him more, more, more money and so that we need government to support him too. It is very good because this can take us fast transportation. If there's any problem, we can be able to move from one place to another. I want to do like him. Yes. <laughs> so I cannot try to come to office. <laughs> I'm carry my family, carry my children, take them to school. Let's find out more about this amphibious jet car. So how long did it take you to, to build this? This one took me just only three months. But if we are empowered, we can do more than this. You know, we use junk to build this very one now. But if we have the better material, we'll do better than this. Yes, I was inspired by creative dexterity. Simply, urge for creativity. I haven't seen other country building something of this nature. We want Nigerian name to be on the track too. We use Local, 60% local material. Okay. You can see aluminum here, you can see plastic, you can see fiber, you can see steel, you can see wood. This is the control panel. Control panel. If you are, if you are going to the sea, you use the digital jar system. No, no. You use digital jar system on the control panel. But if you are moving along, you can use it, and you can use manual too. Okay. Then it moves 120 km, between 80 to 120 km per hour on land. Okay. And this, the source of energy is is solar and petrol. That means if you run out of petrol, you can use solar. Solar moves between 35 and 45 km per hour. So we made it here in Nigeria. You can see that this is the island of the use steering, which you use in man 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 maneuvering it when you are on the sea, on land, perhaps when we complete the flying aspect. Well, the signal light, when it's on, it shows that the system is intact. Both this, uh, uh, what do you call it, the uh, solar system and the uh, mechanism. There you go. It is his dream, like that of many young Nigerians, to mass produce his invention to boost the country's gross domestic product and put us on the map. I know most of our youth have the talent. Let's come together and use the talent to develop our nation. That's our main objective. Yeah. Yeah. So thank you. This is the time for government to key into creative people like this, waiting to be discovered.